Hi guys, this is my first weekend working as a doctor and I thought I'd bring you along with me. So it's an early start, it's 7.45 we've got to be in for, which honestly feels hellish on a Saturday morning whilst I leave everyone in my family asleep. It's a 30 minute drive for me to get to work, which feels fine and it's actually quite nice to wake me up in the morning. So here I am just beeping in to get into the hospital. Uh, it's around 7.30 at this point. So I'm just starting off, gonna go into the doctor's room and find out, get a hand over from the night, the night doctor room, see how everyone's doing. The corridors are completely empty, so quiet. My day always starts off by updating the list with patients that the night staff has told me about. So as well as adding all the new patients that got admitted overnight, you also have to check the bloods and the observations for all the current patients and check if any imaging results have come back as well. So then you can let the consultant know on the ward round as you're going around and looking at each patient. So you just, this takes about 20 minutes. And then at about 8.15, we head over to the ward to go and have a look at all the patients and see what's going on with them. And um, because I'm on call on this weekend, I have my little bleep here, which is just a really old fashioned way of getting in contact with the doctors. So anyone in the hospital can use the phone to bleep, to bleep me and it's my personal bleep number. So you double click it, it takes a while to get to know how to use it. And then you see the number and just type it in on the phone and give them a call, find out what they need. And it's, sometimes you can answer the query over the phone. Sometimes you need to go to the patient to either prescribe them some drugs, review them. Oh yeah, there's loads of different things that they might need. And then somehow I had got all my jobs done, updated any, everything I needed to with the patients. And then I just ended up being able to watch TV in the doctor's room for hours and hours, <laughs> which did actually get a bit boring, but at least no one was dying. So I've just had, just been asleep for half an hour and um, finally got, I'm just going to go and give some patients some antibiotics and Domino's Pizza has just arrived in the doctor's room for us so that's amazing. Free ice lollies as well because it was 35 degrees I think most hospitals gave their staff free ice lollies which was yummy. And this was not free but it was actually a monster poured out into a Costa cup because if you walk around doctors with energy drinks, you know you're going to get looked at funny. We hear a few patients screaming. The hospital actually gets so creepy at night, especially on a weekend when it's just empty. And hearing patients screaming definitely wasn't helping. But yeah, now it's about eight o'clock and I was ready to go home. No surgeries really happen on the weekend and we managed to discharge most of our patients last week. So luckily no one was that unwell and the most exciting part of my day was probably the free dominoes. I had one more 13 hour shift tomorrow to get through and then I'd be ready for my two days off. <laughs> So we just had some guy presenting with basically heart attack, chest pain. I was the first person there. So scary. I managed to stabilize him and I just ran like, someone help me, to the other doctors. So it's fine in the end, but it was scary. So it's 3 p.m. now and I've still had a break. Um, we had teaching during lunch. So I was like, got a free sandwich. Um, but yeah, I've not even had a break yet. I've got a headache now. I'm gonna just, have a coffee or something and some water. But I think I haven't got time to stop, so I'm gonna keep going. I can't wait to leave. So we're on the train to Waterloo, is that right Dylan? I had how long to get changed? Just 10 minutes. Not enough time to wash my hair. Is and hers. That's <laughs> <laughs> when you watch the damn bought me for my graduation. Okay. <laughs> 
So I've officially finished my weekend and it's my first day of It was really tiring. It was three 13 and a half hour shifts in a row. For the first time as well, someone offered to hold my bleep and it was so nice. After that many hours, working the whole weekend and Monday, I, nearly, I could have actually cried. I genuinely could have cried. I was so happy and I got to get home early. So it was really surprising actually. I've had some uncle shifts that have been so busy. I've had to be running to people having strokes and people are about to go into cardiac arrest. Um, and on Saturday, I spent the whole day in the doctor's mess, eating the free dominoes that they give you, watching TV. And it's like a 70 inch TV. And it was really not that bad. Obviously you're missing out on your weekend with your friends. It was a bit boring, but was actually fine and then the Sunday it did get a bit busier we had a few more admissions but yeah overall it was completely fine um luckily I've managed to avoid night shifts so far uh but yeah so now I've got my two days off and it feels so good to just be at home it's raining now for the first time as well which just feels so nice after it's been 35 degrees in that house feels so sweaty it's just so can't even explain it but yeah so thanks so much for watching and i hope you have a nice week